Hello and welcome back to Monday Minute Live, the show where we support you in coping with this hostile environment. I'm Kip. And I'm Evan. Today we're going to talk about why you cannot change others' behavior. <laughs> well, why are ma- the reasons of why are probably many, but it is a futile attempt to do so because we are all making our own decisions anyway, and we're not even really making decisions. 95% of our thought is subconscious anyway, so it's based on the programming that's been layered in throughout our lives is kind of driving the bus of our actions. And, and before you even think about changing anyone else, ask yourself, if you change your own behavior? Because a lot of times what we're really trying to change as others are things we don't like about ourselves. So start with yourself first because most of us have it. And recognize how hard it is to make changes in ourselves. Getting into an exercise routine or out of a bad relationship or stopping doing that thing we're addicted to, we want to quit. They're very hard. They take a lot of work. And even just trying to tell people what to do, getting over that takes a lot of work. We've done a lot of work on consciously evolving ourselves getting into our heart and discovering what that means and what value system that serves. And when you do, I can tell you from experience, you're going to try a lot less to attach expectations to outcomes in other people. You'll limit it to yourself because you'll know how hard that is to begin with. And that's really what it comes down to is when we move from the fear in the mind of the cacophony, it's always talking and telling us we can do this or should do that. And we come to the still silence and the quiet wisdom of the heart changes everything. The answers become much more simple. We're not trying to control anymore. We're moving from ego and control into acceptance. But guess what? We still always get to create. We're writing this story anyway, for better or for worse. It is our life story to write. We ask that you join us and make it a love story. It's going to be a mad love story, but we're in it. Come to souldocumentary.love and love us because we are going to love you back and stay tuned for our documentary on Jock Fresco and the Venus Project, a world worth imagining. Jock Fresco, a man with a plan, coming to you 11-11. Oh boy, is it ever. And we'll see you next Monday, if not sooner. You know, we have five other shows. We're doing YouTube, Vimeo, website. Check us out. Say hi on social media. Comment below. We want to talk to you. Mad love story coming at you. One, two, three, four. Let's write a mad love story. One that is ours, not mine. Let's write a man.